All right, guys, what's going on? Hump day. So, um, before I get going here, I want to thank um, EMS, uh, EMS Maurice, Irene. Our buckets had our bucket has holes in it, <laughs> or our bucket has holes. Uh, Teresa and Cynthia, thank you guys for the super thanks. Appreciate it. Um, all right. Now, we all know that uh, sometime soon, sometime soon, that uh, Don and Candace are going to be having their, I guess, hearing to determine whether they, you know, get the boys back or not. Um, so, I reached out to a friend of mine again that used to be a CPS worker. And uh, she said that um, if Don and Candace end up losing custody, what CPS may do, they, they could do a couple things here is what she says. She said they could, uh, and again, she is a former CPS worker, not a current CPS worker. Um, former for you people in the back. Get the shit out of yours. Um, said that uh, CPS may let Don and Candace sign away the rights to make it look better on them. Uh, that way Don and Candace can say um, or they can save face, you know, make it look good on them by saying, um, well, we were just looking out for the best interest of our boys is why we done that. Uh, and that that's, you know, if they end up losing custody, let's see if they come out and say that. I'm curious. Well, we done it because we were just, you know, we were just looking out for the best interest of the boys. Um, but she is telling me that a lot of times that they'll let the parents do that. That way it kind of makes them look good. Um, and along with that, um, a lot of times they'll let the parents sign away their rights. Uh, if, you know, it, this is just last ditch effort, guys. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, a lot of times they'll um, let the parents sign away their rights uh, to avoid charges. She says she's seen that happen. So if you've worked with CPS or whatever it's called where you're at, um, I'd like to hear from you in the comments below. Have you seen where they let parents, you know, sign away their rights at the end of it? You know, if it's just not going to happen and they get their kids back. Um, have you heard of like a uh, agreement to let them sign away their rights and uh, avoid charges? Because she's heard that. She's seen that too. Of course, all states are different. Don't know. <clears throat> um, and here's something else I want to talk about too. Uh, we all know that they've been on YouTube a lot. And where they and when they were on YouTube... It never was about summer. It never was really about any progress, progress that they were making to get the boys back. It was just, anytime they were really on YouTube, it was uh, going at other YouTubers, arguing, bickering at other YouTubers. You know, it wasn't, it's never been a dedicated YouTube video on, anybody's channel um well i take that back share for voices behind a wall she 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 done first couple interviews with don and candace she done pretty good um but other than that it's just you know really just been a shit show arguing with other youtubers bickering cussing getting drunk and pulled over while on youtube you know what I mean? We'll never forget that. Um, I 
but yeah, anytime they were on here, it's never really been about summer or finding summer. Um, or it's never been about any progress that they're making to get the boys back. Um, you have to pardon me, guys. I'm freezing. I know I've got a hoodie on, but I'm also in shorts. So, oh, um, again, and I'll stress this again. Um, and I don't know how many others feel this way too, but, um, I really feel like once the case with the boys is over, it will open new doors for Summer's case to start making more ground. Uh, I do think that the detectives once, uh, and TBI, once Summer's case, or once the boys' case is closed, uh, it will give them, uh, I think, a, like a almost like a fresh start in Summer's case to do what they need to there because we all heard uh, John Pruitt say that the boys case is bleeding over into Summer's case and I think they need to get the boys case out of the way done with completely and then they can do what they need to in Summer's case so uh, that being said um, hopefully soon if we see something happen in the custody issue with the boys regarding Don and Candace after that's over and hopefully it'll be soon uh, uh, we'll uh, we'll see investigators jumping on Summer's case um Maybe with some fire under their feet, you know what I mean? So, let me know what you think in the comments below, especially on the, uh, if you've worked with CPS, or if you haven't, have you heard of uh, CPS letting parents sign away their rights to uh, avoid charges? And also to make it look good, make it look good on them too. So, uh, uh, let me know what you think, guys. Let me know what you think. Comment below, and see you on the next video.